In this tutorial, I will show you how to open new windows. So let's create a new JavaFX project. Now we want to add JavaFX library to our project. In my case, it will be program files, Java, JavaFX SDK 16 library. OK. So now your project has three files, controller, main, and sample FXML. So let's begin with the uh, sample FXML. Let me copy controller class, remove grid paint. I personally prefer to use anchor paint. Let me add one controller. Paste controller class. So this button. Let me just say um, open new window. FXID uh, BTN new window. Event handler. Handle BTN new window. Save it. Okay, let's add data field. Change the private. Add annotation. Add um, event handler methods. As you can see, I'm using JavaFX 16. That comes with uh, JavaFX in Builder 16. Let's build. VM options. Model pass. Pass to your JavaFX SDK library. Add models. In my case, I'm going to use JavaFX controls and uh, JavaFX FXML. Apply, OK. So when you click this button, it's supposed to open window. Okay. So we are going to open, create FXML. I will say new window. Here it says that uh, package name should be sample and then controller name should be new window. So let's create a new controller on the same package. Same uh, new window. Okay, same name. Make sure you use the same name. So new window controller class will handle a new window.fxml. Let's implement initializable. You need to implement uh, initialize method. That's all. Then here, let's add um, some pretty simple um, UI. Just make sure you have a new window as a controller. Anchor pane. Okay. Let me add one label. Okay. 
So this is a new window. Save it. So as you can see, we are using uh, JavaFX 16. So this is a main controller. This is a main class. So if you look at uh, main, this is how we handle uh, sample FXML with a stage. So let me copy, paste it. So this one says that um, we need to have sample FXML. But this particular one, we're going to control new window FXML. And uh, here it says that we need to use a method okay, that handle exception. So through IO exception. For primary stage, it should be a stage class named as a primary stage, new stage. You may need to import um, stage class on the JavaFX stage. You can use uh, Alt Enter, or you can add uh, import statement by yourself. Again, we need a scene. I will say uh, just scene. Okay, new scene. That refers to um, root. That one I will change to new window. So primary stage, initial mortality, there are three types, non-window model or application model. So default is uh, non, if you don't do anything, it will consider as a non. So if you have a two window, you can close uh, whichever you want. That's the meaning of uh, mortality non. So let me change this part as a um, scene so it can be matched. Okay, so you can close this window or the other window. You can open close anything you want. So let's use a uh, application model. So this is what we call as a new window. Okay, you, I am actually trying to close. You won't be able to close a uh, parent's window unless you close the new window. So that's this. Uh, that was the application model. Window model. Um, you can actually set your own behavior so that uh, you can control. So primary stage, so here, initial owner. In this case, you can uh, point to one object belongs to that particular window. So in my case, I will say um, PTN new window, the button we have.
and we use a get same. Here method is a get window, not get stage. Okay. So this is a somehow strange get window. So specify owner window for new window. So in my case, I specify for parent window. So open it. Okay. You cannot control. So you have to close new window in order to close uh, parent's window. If you don't specify uh, owner, the behavior is going to be same as a uh, uh, modality none. Here you can close any one, any window you want. So in practice, I think the modality with the uh, application model make more sense. Uh, you must close a new window, then you can close the parent's window. So that's the main idea of using a new window, even though in Java FX we call it a new stage. So there are three options, uh, window model, none, and then application model. You can pick uh, whichever you want. Normally, I use uh, application model. It make more sense to me. Again, uh, here, name somehow strange. So let me change to uh, window new window controller refactor rename so I will rename it as a new window controller make sure this name also change okay so sample new window controller okay that's okay now let's build run it again A new window, close it, close it, it works, okay. So that's the minor things you may need to change to make it more consistent, okay. For new window, you have a, a FXML and then new window controller. And then original one, you have a main and sample FXML and controller class. That's all, thank you.